So how much water is too much water? It seems a pretty hot topic these days with some people throwing science around on the subject. So do the research. Too much water or hyponatremia is about an imbalance of sodium and electrolytes and is fairly difficult to achieve. It usually happens through long bouts of sweating with exertion and exercise like marathon runners or endurance athletes. Drinking too much water and not replacing the electrolytes can cause hyponatremia. It can also happen if you drink too much water in a short period of time. And there are other risk factors as well, such as medications, diuretics, kidney problems, hyperthyroidism, and others. So ask your doctor if you have conditions that increase your risk. Another common cause is dehydration. Dehydration can cause the loss of electrolytes. So drinking too much water too fast without replacing the electrolytes can cause problems. Notice the theme here, dehydration, lost electrolytes, too much water too fast, and not replacing the electrolytes. As in all things, moderation is the key here. Look, in a healthy adult, kidneys can process up to 15 liters a day. So drinking half your weight in ounces of water over the course of a normal day is not likely detrimental. One source actually suggests that athletes drink one half to one ounce of water per pound of body fat each day. So for as normal people exercising moderately, 64 ounces to half our body weight seems viable. As for water diluting stomach acids to the point of interfering with digestion, opinions vary. Drinking anything less than 8 ounces of water during a meal is unlikely to cause any adverse effect. And actually some doctors, including one on the Mayo Clinic website, state that water can actually aid in digestion. Go figure. So if you're concerned about drinking too much water, then the best thing to do is to check with your doctor and do what's best for you and your body.